Welcome to another uh, iPhone programming tutorial. Uh, in this tutorial we're going to learn how to create a custom component and uh, specifically we're going to create a custom uh, button. Uh, those uh, custom buttons, uh, what they do is when you click on them, they perform an animation when clicked. So if I click an alpha button, so you see it fades uh, out and back in, and if I click horizontal bo button, so it like flips, and the vertical button it flips vertically. So uh, what we'll learn here is how to subclass a UI view uh, to create a custom component. And I'm gonna learn a bit a bit about uh, iPhone animation, which is a uh, pretty easy to do, uh, amazing uh, animation with very little, little code. So we're gonna touch up on that, and we're gonna learn a bit about delegation because our a button transfer tra needs to transfer. Uh, and the click event to uh, delegate. So uh, we're gonna touch up on a bit about delegation. So uh, okay, let's uh, start the tutorial. Okay, so let's start. Uh, launch up your Xcode. And we're gonna go to File, New, project. We're gonna make sure iOS application is selected and we're gonna uh, choose a single view application. Choose next. We're gonna name it. I'm gonna name it uh, buttons are fun. And we're gonna make sure it's for the iPhone. We're not gonna use the storyboard and uh, we're gonna choose next and select the path you want to save it and choose create. Okay, so uh, we got our uh, default uh, project lay layout here. So we're gonna want to first, first of all, create a UI view subclass, uh, which is basically uh, the custom buttons uh, we're gonna create. So go to the main folder, uh, right click and choose new file. And make sure iOS is marked and uh, choose Objective C class, choose next. And we're gonna name it KS Custom Button. And we're gonna choose next. And we're gonna save the file wherever in the in our project and choose create. And okay, we're gonna header file and the implementation file. Uh, so we're gonna start uh, with the code in the header file. So we're gonna we're gonna walk on the code. Uh, you get the full the full uh, code and uh, knowledge dash share dot co dot uh, il and I'm gonna explain the code here. So uh, we're gonna uh, create a class called case custom button and we're gonna define uh, enum and this enum represents uh, the types of animation uh, that our buttons is compatible with. So you can feel free to add here if you want, like another uh, animation, uh, like change color or I don't know, whatever you want. So just uh, add here another uh, type and implement it uh, in the implementation. So this is, a, we call this in uh, animation type. We're currently uh, compatible with an alpha, horizontal flip, and vertical flip. Uh, okay, the next section we're gonna it's uh, for the de delegate object. Uh, we're gonna define a protocol which the delegate needs to implement. So uh, basically, we want to pass forward the button uh, touch touched up inside of it. So the delegate should uh, uh, should uh, uh, create a method called button clicked, uh, which the, our custom button will be connected to. And basically, whenever uh, our custom button is clicked, the delegate will receive, uh, will invoke the button clicked event in the delegate object. So, okay, we're gonna go to the uh, interface. Our interface, uh, we have uh, these uh, variables. The first one uh, represents a delegate object, and it's of type ID, a generic type, and it implements uh, our protocol that we define here and implement uh, basically we're saying we want a generic uh, type which uh, delegates this protocol 
So okay, we got a button, our uh, main button of the view. This button will uh, uh, will uh, resize on the entire view, will fill up the entire view, and we got our uh, animation type, will, which will hold uh, the animation type. So I can create uh, this custom button with an alpha or horizontal flip, whatever I want. We set. Uh, this is a property, and this is an antidelegate of the property, and we can uh, pretty much uh, set by these properties the type of animation, animation, and the delegation object. So uh, the properties we've spoken about are also implemented the method uh, to change the title of a button. So if I want to from the uh, delegate object to change the title, I can just call this method and pass it uh, in a string and the button will have a title. You can also add here uh, whatever methods you may want like uh, re regarding the button like you want to I don't know change the background or just add it here and invoke the button method on those on those function you create. Uh, so uh, that's it for the header file. Uh, from now we're gonna go on to the implementation file.